Hello, I'm gonna be talking about the easiest ways you can make money. Make sure you like the video and make sure you subscribe. The first thing I'm gonna be talking about is solo cash cups. How you can win games mainly with the balloon strategy. So basically, if you can get the balloon perk, which is pretty common, you should be able to get up most games. And you can get yourself a hammer. Once you get to end game, if you hammer up with two balloons on, you can stay in the air for literally the whole game. It's really OP because if you don't get shot out, you can go into like a 1v1 at the very end with cat mats, cap splash, and everything you need busy. Uh, so it's probably the easiest way you can win a game this meta. So in this game, Nipsey has his balloon, his hammer. He goes up with two balloons, he goes all the way up. In a second, he should get his third balloon. And then he's just gonna keep going up like all the way to max out. Yeah, so he gets his third balloon. And you fly all the way up. You get all the way up, Your one of your balloons pops, I think, once you're at max out. Maybe not for Nipsey. Yeah, one of, one of your balloons pops, but you should get it back before you hit the ground. So you can stay up here for literally the whole game, uh, up until last zone. Like, Nipsey gets into a 1v1, he has 1k mats, 7 splash. You can't be in a better position to win a game realistically. Um, so as long as you don't lose your 1v1, or unless you lose heal off or something, you should win a game. So there isn't much I can help with for no builds. It is a lot of just raw aim and knowing what to do in certain situations, how to rotate, uh, and just game knowledge in general. But one thing that everyone can have is like the best loadout possible. So with this season, the only protection are these shields and porta bunkers. So you're going to want two people holding porta bunkers and two people holding shields because porta bunkers are just good in almost every situation and shield uh if you throw one down um when it runs out of charge you can just throw your other one down and when that one runs out of charge your original shield you can put that back down it's basically an infinite wall that can't be broken so if you can get that if you can get two of them they're pretty common you should be able to get two of them every game that's like ideal if you can get hammer, this is kind of like towards the late games, so we all have hammer this game, but that's not realistic that you get it every single time. Um, but if you can take hammer, it's good for like claiming a position or W keying. And everyone kind of needs like splash or keg. You only really need one heal. And then of course, everyone has a red eye because it's the best AR by far compared to scare. And then you can have SMG or shotgun. It doesn't really matter for that one. But yeah, that's kind of the best I can help you with for nobles. You mainly just need to know what to do and when, which just comes with experience.